Assalamu alaikum and welcome to the series called Asma'ul Husna or the beautiful names and lofty attributes of Allah. For today's episode, we'll be talking about Al Akram, the most generous. Al Akram is a characteristic name of Allah that points to the generosity of the Almighty. He is the one who controls everything. He showers his blessings on whom he wills and with no bounds. His bounties are immeasurable. Allah bestows his kindness on whom he wills and reminds us of his presence. He gives everyone what he wills and is never unfair to his creatures. One does not have to ask always and yet gets all he or she needs for his or her survival. Allah the Almighty is the most benevolent. He bestows His blessings in what He wills. In return, all He wants is obedience from His creatures. He is our sustainer and provides us with all that we need. We should be grateful and submissive to Him. In the Quran, He says, Iqra bismi ladi khalaq. Recite in the name of your Lord who created all things. Khalaq al insana min alaq. Has created man from a clot of blood. Iqra wa rabbuka al akram. Recite, and your Lord is al akram, the most generous. Allah is gracious and holds the greatness of power, and his glory of status is matchless. He gives to all beings. He has blessed his righteous servants. Allah always shows his kindness and generosity towards us by giving to us. We do not have to ask for each and everything that we want or need. Yet, He gives us all that is good for us and is beneficial. He always gives to whom He wills of His creation. There is also another name of Allah that's almost synonymous to Al-Akram, and that is Al-Karim. Ya ayyuhal insanu ma gharraka bi rabbika al-Karim. O man, what has made you careless concerning your Lord, Al Karim, the most generous? Iqra wa Rabbuk al Akram. Recite, and your Lord is Al Akram, the most generous. Al Karim means the benefactor. There is no doubt in the plentiful and abundant graces that Allah bestows upon His slaves. The name Al Karim comprises the most generous, the forgiver, and the Almighty. Allah is attributed with being generous, with abundant good, gracious, and he forgives and bestows upon his slave. Accordingly, the difference between Al-Akram and Al-Karim is that Al-Akram is an attribute for the essence of Allah, and Al-Karim is the attribute of the action of Allah. Allah is the most generous in the sense that he who gives without taking something in return, he who gives without a reason, he who needs no means, he who does not care to whom he gives, whether it be a believer or a kafir, grateful or ungrateful. He who gives before one asks. Al-Aqram is the most generous of all the generous ones. No one is comparable to him or equivalent to him in his generosity or nobility. Al-Aqram comprises the intrinsic attribute, while Al-Karim comprises the practical attribute. Allah, all praises and glory be to Him, is Al-Akram, the most generous. It is He who gives us life, causes us to grow, and sustains us. He provides us with food, shelter, and clothing as He pleases. He is not in need of any of us or our worship. This illustrates how generous He is in sustaining us, even those who do not worship Him or even acknowledge His existence. Allah tells us in Hadith Qudsi that He loves to respond to the believer who supplicates to Him. Were He to ask of me, I would surely give Him. And were He to ask me for refuge, I would surely grant Him it. Allah loves to respond to our du'as. So let's call Him using His glorious name, Al-Akram and ask him for what we need. Verily, he is the most generous. Stay tuned in the next installment of the series. I'll see you in the next episode.
Hey, if you want to know the complete list of the 99 names of Allah, check out this video here.